Okay, uh, so uh, the last few webinars have been in different places, on the airport, I was at the terrace in Istanbul, and now, today, I'm at the beach club. I will show you guys how it is. It's definitely going on. Turkey, uh, see a place called Ayorgi, very good DJ over here. And I found the most quiet corner. Oh, I'm working, I'm actually on this, so I'm working like that one. That's the beauty of being a freelancer, working everywhere, from everywhere forever. Uh, in today's webinar, we have a lot of stuff. It will be a bit shorter than usual. Uh, and at the end of it, it will be a Q&A. So I'll get this rolling now. So today I will cover uh, uh, the first the weekly review of our sites. We have about 10 sites now and we plan to build 90 more this year. Uh, like I said in my invitation email, it was kind of, uh, I mean, we messed up a bit, but we learned some very valuable lessons from so I think it's uh, actually for the better, but it was a kind of a painful week, I would say. Uh, and then I will uh, cover a bit if you want to manage your own site, you don't want to go through a normal roadmap with the reward points and the reward webinars. Uh, I will explain a bit. Uh, I will also uh, say which new projects were launched. It's also a big deal this week. So we have a lot of regular sites coming in, and then we have the Q and A. So I will jump just right into the review money side. I hope you guys hear me good, but do not see. So as you see here on the list, it's much greener than last week. Um, Sana site. Uh, Huystensirto.net got its first organic lead. Uh, she has done a really good job on improving the speed of the site and added seven more clinics. And she actually has two uh, keywords in the top ten. Um, I would say, I mean, what was really good done is like, I mean, the organic lead is good, uh, the clinic, and then you actually have eight. Uh, keywords in the top 30 so we are close to tipping point on the sites in terms of organic leads uh, what you need to do some now when you see this is that you need to do uh, improve the speed uh, it's too slow and uh, I think that's the lowest hanging fruit and then you need to do a bit more uh, it would be good if you did like five ten more uh, clinics I will help you find some with searches, it's not so easy in Finland. And then we, uh, you should do the review page that uh, Lasse did. I mean, her husband actually did a fantastic review page. Uh, and if I go to hårdtransplantation.com, Linda's site, I mean, uh, leads have gone through the roof, 300% increase, uh, all of them from ads, but Ad spend went down 65%, which you see here. Speed, st uh, I mean, it's on it's 179. Uh, it's very good. It could probably be approved a bit more. Uh, and you added three more clinics for a total of 11, so that's good. You also have um, five in the top 30. So you, you, you have some uh, keywords that are going to rank very soon. What you should do, uh, I think, for next week is just add more clinics and do the review summary page. I will show that uh, a bit later on uh, what I mean there. Uh, Leon Turnquist, uh, fantastic with review. I mean, we got uh, nine new leads this week, 200% increase, and cost went down 72%. Uh, I think it's a lot of stuff. Probably also a bit seasonal, but I mean, uh, fantastic. It actually is uh, 
really makes sense then now. So both on hårdtransplantation.com and hårdtransplantation.new, uh, I will triple budgets on these ones for the next uh, week and see what happens. Um, clinics, you added, uh, not 47, you added four this week. It's good. Uh, you're on holiday, so I think it's a really good job. Um, you, it would be fantastic, though, if we could reach like 20 by next Thursday. What you need to do, yeah, more clinics and then the review page, uh, the summary page that will boost up a lot. Uh, Ram Dentaria, um, you have done a lot of stuff. You have done, uh, added a lot of new clinics. Uh, I mean, five new, uh, but you still, I actually paused all the ads because we're basically throwing money out of the window. Uh, it needs way more uh, PLC. And I mean, the site speed uh, must uh, go up. So I suggest that next week you work mainly on uh, improving the site. I mean, uh, before you do anything else, uh, try to improve the site speed because at 95, I mean, uh, it's not worth spending money on ads uh, or anything actually. Uh, so, so, so that site, you just took it over. So it needs a bit more love. Uh, then for the first disaster, so what happened last week is that uh, we decided to port hairlinetransplantturkey.com to uh, Elementor. And as you can see here, that was a very expensive uh, porting. So the original idea was that we uh, ported it on uh, Monday after careful review, but for different reasons, uh, we managed to port it on a Saturday and uh, it ended up, uh, I mean, uh, increasing the cost per lead with 130% from 8 euro to 19 euro. And instead of 74 paid leads, we only managed to get 32. And the reason here is actually, I mean, I, I also said, like, what we did good then when we moved to Elementor was that we, I mean, we increased the speed from 110 to 170. So, I mean, the, the, the decision to move it to Elementor and do all that work, that was fantastic. We just did a small mistake. And I will show you guys what now. And so the original version you see here to the left, it's, um, it used to look like this. So, uh, Highland Transplant Turkey, find the best offers. And then when we ported it, I mean, not such a big change. Uh, how much difference in conversion do you think the original to the first way, uh, version made until we managed to fix it? If you check the version now, it is looking way better. But uh, could you please write in the chat here trying to open it uh, so the original one uh, the one uh, to the left it was 10% conversion rate what do you think the conversion rate was in percentages on the first version uh, so if you're right there you have 20% Samuel that uh, no it's not 20% uh, uh, yeah, uh, Rachel, maybe you can like uh, ask those kind of things in the in the end. Uh, right now, I'm curious if if anybody has an opinion on what uh, uh, what the conversion was in the middle version. Okay, so nobody has a guess. That's, uh, that's boring. Exactly. Uh, sorry, Anne, I cannot do anything about the sound. I'm really sorry about that. Uh, 
No. Okay. So the 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 original version was 10% conversion. So that means that of other 100 visitors to the site, uh, 10 of them fill in the form. Uh, in the middle version, it was. Okay. So. Uh, uh, in the middle version, it was 0.5%. So we managed to uh, drop the um, conversion with, I mean, we, we made it 20 times worse. So uh, as an exercise here, uh, I would like you to, uh, I would like you to, I mean, think about it. And if you have a good version, uh, please reach out to me in the chat or by email jamatwordup.com and come up with the changes you think we should do on the site. I mean, if you are a person that uh, knows how to do this visually. So, I mean, with the sound here, maybe it was not the best idea I had in the world to, to, uh, to do this here. I was frankly not aware of uh, that they're going to start playing music right away. Uh, exactly. Thank you, Jan. Uh, so then we also did a change on hairlinetransplantation.com. We totally changed our funnel there and uh, boosted the speed. Uh, the reason why the the cost went up so much is because we changed the funnel. So we introduced Calendly on it. Uh, not to have so much manual work and in the beginning I think our call to actions and stuff were not that good it's pick, picking up now uh, what we did here I mean it's actually a pretty good page so um, I want to show that uh, I have to close this one I guess so So what we did was that we introduced a free personal loss assessment report and we changed the flow. We also rewrote all the metas. And I mean, I'm a very big fan of proper metas and I think um, you will see why. Uh, we did here a total review. Lassen did a fantastic job with this page here together with Jorn. We're doing a top list of it. And I think all of us, you can rip this up with your own version of it. Um, because we're going to list all your clinics like that. Having them as a drop down here is not so user friendly and it doesn't, frankly doesn't work on mobile at all. So it will basically be if you click on clinic reviews, you will end up in this page. And uh, we also improved the page here a lot. I mean, it starts to look like a really good page, I would say. Um, with FIQs and stuff like that. We have work uh, here to do, but it's really good. And what happened when we did this was that we immediately got a top eight position for one of the most competitors keywords ever. I mean, the si it's the site name, of course, that's why we bought the domain, but hairlinetransplantation.com went from nothing to an eighth position with 1K monthly searches just because of the changes we did. And I think uh, you ever could check the methods there. Uh, they are pretty thought through. That's how methods and method description should look actually uh, for them to get the boost. And uh, the biggest mistake is was with it was that uh, the keyword was not the first word. That was one of the biggest mistakes. Okay, so so I mean, all in all, uh, Monica and, and uh, you're working on heartrustpatacon.com. I mean, edit.dk. It will come up. Uh, we also have. We're looking for German, German Evas for hardtransplantation.com. Uh, Masaru has started working on the Japanese site and Tuba will start working on suchchecking.com. But frankly, we have like 90 more sites in 15 different languages where we're looking for site managers. Unfortunately, uh, we don't have 
a budget for all 90 at once because uh, it's 500 euro per side so that would be 45,000 euro per month that we would uh, just add on this side plus I mean uh, all the ads and around uh, uh, that kind of thing so uh, if you want to become an EVA uh, a known for a normal uh, roadmap I will come to that later and if you want to do our fast track then uh, I mean as long as you check out on these four skills like excellent writing skills you want to continuous learning uh, frankly the first three months is kind of a 10 years of experience boiled down to three months so a lot of people that started are under the impression that wow yeah okay uh, I can spend 10 hours a week on this and uh, all will be good you won't I mean it, it is a lot to learn and a lot of info to digest and to reach the point where Sanna or Helian Turnquist is now it's it, it takes a lot of effort so if you don't have the time uh, you should probably take it the, uh, the slower way of doing it, which is also fine, of course. And if you want, but if you want to do it like you feel like I want to get started now, I want to make 500 euro a month and I want my own site, uh, we can fast track you. And what we need is for you and someone you pair up with to recruit 15 people living in Sweden and Finland. And you could, uh, you have to, of course, participate in our writing webinars. You can reach out to the EVAs here in the list and uh, pass the tests. But if you recruit these people and you reach 120 devices reviews, uh, you'll get your own site like this in any language uh, with the guaranteed 500 euro a month for the two, first three months. Then uh, we will look at your performance, of course. But if you can write and you can find these people, I mean, uh, you need to find anyone living in Sweden or Finland that want to earn uh, about 60 euro a month uh, uh, doing uh, devices reviews and if you don't know what that is uh, there is tons of videos about it or uh, um, I even think we have a webinar about it or if we don't have them I mean Jörn do we have a webinar about uh, devices reviews Okay, so we will have a webinar about that, but I mean, uh, step one is finding the people. Uh, you basically Google a keyword and you take the screenshot of how it looks in the search because Google uh, uh, makes it look differently. And then you go into the site and score the site on uh, speed and quality of text and stuff like that. It takes about two, three minutes and you do between six and ten of those each time. Uh, so you need to find people that do that and they get paid two euro per review and you as a person that find them, uh, you will be coached by an EVA. So uh, the total pay for you is 40 cents, but you have to share it with an EVA where they get 20%. However, if you get, uh, get up to 120 of these reviews, which is more or less 15 people then we will give you a site where you will uh, write your own text and earn 500 euro a month um, and also if you know please if you reach out to me in the chat if you know any fun I mean I'm talking about exceptional writer in German and English I'm really looking for I have a lot of work but uh, it needs to be an ex-journalist or someone that is very used to writing. Uh, the level of the text are like, here's one uh, reach art article that we did. Uh, I can, I can Skype, uh, I can add it here in the chat actually. So, I mean, if you can write really good, in, uh, if you know anyone or you can write really, really good in these languages, I mean, I will give you a keyword, uh, then uh, you will get some coaching, of course, but uh, 
the woman who wrote, uh, who wrote this article, she's currently moving to France, so she can't work for and, and uh, quitting her old job, so she cannot write for two months, uh, Joanna. But in September she's back, but she used to be a journalist for Reuters, and it's that kind of level we're looking for. We have tons of work for that, and you will get right away a site. And the same for German. Uh, oh, the part is really going on here. I'm really sorry about this, guys. Uh, if uh, and if you don't, if you don't know how to write like that, then the good news is that we have project with reward webinars. There will be regular reward webinars where you will be able to, uh, with your reward points, and you get eight reward points if you write in the wordup.com chat after, directly after the webinar. If you write it tomorrow, you're not going to get the reward points. You go in there, you write, hi, I joined. We will check that you joined, and then you'll get your reward points. So that's how it works. Um, so um, uh, you can use those reward points, and. We are, I mean, me or Jorn, or we are not running these webinars. We will, uh, it's Sanna. Sanna has over 30 sites. I mean, I think she has actually 50 sites that she's building each month. She has tons of needs of great people. She's running a webinar, and the purpose of the webinar is to find and train great writers. So you join that one, and it will be blog posts. Uh, first, you have to write a good blog post. You don't get paid much, that's not the purpose. It's about writing in a, learning how to write in a peculiar way or proving that you can write. And if you write good, you immediately get more work from her because she needs to delegate work, basically. And it's the same for Swedish. I mean, you see here, we have a lot of sites coming. Good news. Uh, we finalized the deal for end of uh, August for Turkish, where it will be 10 sites a month. Um, uh, also, four in Dutch and four in French. So, um, I mean, there's coming stuff in all the languages, basically. So, now the good news is that uh, <laughs> my talk is finished. So, it will be a Q&A now where, I mean, how do we do this smartest, Jorn? Do we write in the chat or do we open a different thing for this where I mute myself or uh, okay, so we do it in the Q&A. Okay, so it sounds quite good now. Okay, good. Okay, then, then I, I got really stressed. I'm really sorry about this. <laughs> uh, so then, I mean, then I will read it out. So if you write in the Q&A, so the purpose of this Q&A is if you want to find out what an EVA is or, I mean, I mean, why I am out uh, on different places all the time. I'm very passionate about the freedom of working remotely. Uh, I think that WordUp can offer everyone. We can, I mean, we can teach you what has taken me 20 years to learn and Jorn 10 years to learn. We've been doing this for a very long time. And uh, if you want to put in the effort, you will not only be able to earn some money from us, but you will also be able to do this for yourself, kind of. So please use this q &A to ask any questions. I mean, if you want to find out what an EVA role is, just watch our old webinars. Uh, I, I repeated myself a lot there. Uh, but if you have any, yeah, Fredrik. Yeah. Okay, I will start with answering questions. Here. So Fredrik, yeah, I just said that it's work in Norwegian here, but, uh, I mean, you cannot just go into the task feed anymore and get work. I mean, you you have to um, earn some reward points. You're getting eight from this webinar, so that's good. Uh, and then you will do some small tests to run the entire that we are training, their EVAs. And if you prove that you write good and add value to them, I mean, exceptionally, then they will give you more work because we have, I mean, uh, eight sites a month that you can build and uh, I mean we also have naked and uh, tons of other stuff but they're running all of these projects so you can kind of do an interview with them is this the web I mean I don't know if it's the q and then we will put it somewhere else.
Yon, the Q&A is not opening. Okay. Uh, I mean, you have to write. Supposed to minimize this a lot. I don't. Know, I don't understand. Like the the, the Q and A is not opening when I click on it. <laughs> so there's three questions in the first one. Well. It's a false share. What happens then? No. I mean, you're, yeah, you're I'm posting them in the chat. Huh? I'm posting them in the chat, okay? Yeah, yeah post them in the chat because it's not working. Okay, how are you getting the eight points? You write in the wordup.com chat. So it's. Um, you just write your name and your wordup ID and. Uh, Say that you join the webinar and then you will get the eight points like one day or two days after. Uh, you should, Ivilla, if you think that you can find, uh, so uh, I'm asking Villa now. So uh, Villa is asking if I recruit people to Google Devices project, do I send them a link to existing Google Docs template or do I need to make my own? If you think you can uh, recruit these people, uh, you will do your own project. Uh, you can partner up with someone if it's, uh, I mean, you can do both Swedish and Finnish. You can actually do two projects. We only care about the total there. So um, you will do your own projects and please reach out to us in the chat uh, on wordup.com and just say, I think I can find 15 people. Uh, or pick, I mean, uh, uh, I think I can recruit people uh, and, uh, and I want to manage them and get them a training. How do we proceed? And then we will do a webinar or something where we organize it for you. So that's it. Okay. So uh, apart from the webinars, can you try to get more English tasks where we can earn money? We have over 200 uh, English tasks in the backlog, I mean, each month. Uh, the issue is not that. The issue is uh, that you need to be really good at writing. And uh, if you're not getting more jobs, it's for two reasons. Either your writing is not good enough, and it could be because you have been a bit sloppy or didn't understand the role. I mean, we will, or the Evas will look at, um, uh, it's not this chat, Villa. <laughs> uh, uh, we will look, I mean, the Eva, uh, say Linda, for example, she has tons of stuff to do, and one of our biggest KPIs is to recruit people, so, and train people. That, so if she wants to take a day off, she needs to have um, someone doing it for her. Uh, and if you write a text that is has a bit of typos, is not so good, you have not read the uh, webinars on how to write, I mean, watch the webinars on how to write, I mean, it doesn't make any sense for her to give you more work, right? So. Uh, we have a lot of English work, uh, we have a lot of sites to build, uh, it's the level. And the best way to do this is to join the writing webinars. So those are organized by the EVAS, uh, Linda at wordupper.com, you can ask her when she has the next, it should be next Wednesday. Uh, you get some points for joining it and you get some coaching while you do it and then it's up to you to prove her that you can write. Uh, so Fredrik is asking, what level writer have you got to be and what rating do you have to be? In order to get this uh, um, uh, reward um, 
task or like prove yourself to the Eva, I mean, you don't need any experience at all, really. I mean, what you need, though, is that when you write the text, that this, um, I mean, that's why you use this eight reward point, it has to be a good text. I mean, it, and it takes time to become good at writing for the web. So, I mean, and anyone can do it. You just have to join. So these, these all of these tasks here, they are, uh, I mean, it's the ones where we train you. And if you write good on those, then you will get like other texts. You will get clinic reviews. Linda is writing here in the chat now. I mean, she's saying uh, that, uh, I mean, it's next Wednesday, 7 p.m. UK time. I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, Linda, right, correct me if I'm wrong, but I mean, uh, your biggest wish right now is probably to find two exceptional English writers so you can produce this 80 or 100 penny text that you have in the background, right? Uh, oh yes, Linda says that. So where, el um, so where else can I get more reward points to unlock more tasks apart from attending the webinar? Yeah, I mean, uh, you don't need any endless points. Impress that you get access for now. I mean, uh, it, it is the, the system with the reward points and this uh, reward webinars, it is that uh, based on your experience, so I've been writing for the web for like, I mean, doing SEO for the last 15 years. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that uh, I am doing that I've learned over these years that I mean, it takes a while to get into that. You cannot just say like, yeah, I used to write a bit in school and I like writing and then suddenly I write good. No, I mean, you need to write really good. And I mean, SEO is not like it used to be. It's, uh, you have to write stuff where people really learn stuff. So the reward points are, I mean, if you make eight, 10 reward points, you get a free transfer. So we, we get charged by PayPal and the banks and then we say like, okay, but we, 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 we want a way for, the, uh, for our people to be able to do um, free transfers, but we cannot give unlimited free transfers because then, I mean, some people will withdraw five euro. I mean, and we have a transaction cost for each of them. So reward points are used for that. And it's also used for opening up tasks for the training tasks where you don't get paid much. Uh, uh, but we have to pay the Eva and the editor to, uh, to coach you. So it's a training thing. Okay, Kevin, you're not listening. I mean, uh, it's wordup.com. It's the chat over there. So, um, yeah, I think it's a good start. Like, if you put it there, then we will help you. Or maybe you're not listening. Maybe you're not understanding. So you have to... You have to put the chat, the, the, like, the, you, you, in order to get the eight reward points, you go to wordup.com, and then the chat there. Okay, uh, then I have a question. Can't I work and write solo without working with or in a team? This is because I have 10 years of experience writing on several sites and I already earned some euro on wordup.com. Uh, no. Uh, so the reason for that is incredibly simple. What happens, uh, you can, I mean, you can go in the task feed. So you can, um, uh, one way of doing it is this. Um, I, 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 uh, I was interpreting like, like, can I do it as an Eva? But uh, as a normal writer, so an Eva, let's say Sanna, uh, Sanna has tons of work. She's our person. She gets 13%. Uh, sometimes she shares this with other people to manage the client and the projects for us. And uh, also to assure quality and also to train people. So uh, she will give you the job. So what is, if you don't see it in the task feed, it's because she has decided that it's too much work for her to give it. So if you make, if you impress Sanna in this case, Finnish, but it can be any language, it's the same principle, and she likes your job, uh, she will give you tasks. And she might even agree on you to give it on a weekly basis or uh, on a per site basis. That's up to her, we don't interfere with that. Um, if you want to be an Eva, 
the reason why you can't is when you get sick and I'm not, uh, or you want to have a day off and I get a job and I got the job yesterday and express side, two sides, we have to have them ready by tomorrow. Uh, and you have a day off. I mean, Linda is traveling now and she's super busy. Either she works in the night or she trains someone that does it for her. So that, that's the only way you can do it there. That's how the system works. Okay, and this was the last question for today. I really enjoyed these webinars and next time I learn my lesson, I will try to be at a bit more quiet place. Uh, I'm still uh, traveling a bit, so I will be somewhere in Turkey. Uh, if you go to wordup.com courses and the first webinar there, it's my webinar. Uh, you will find, you can just sign up for it. Sign up for it now if you want to hear more. Next week I will probably have some other interesting stuff to say. I don't know what yet. And you can also find more information here in the uh, Word.com courses and uh, or Word.com. Word up, we post all our recordings there uh, based on views. I see that not many people are watching them. Uh, there's a lot of good info there. And then we also have WordUp.com onboarding where you can uh, find the info about stuff. So thank you very much, guys. Have a nice day and weekend. I am actually going to the sea now uh, to swim. Okay, see you guys. Bye-bye.